Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Panini Flawless Football. Plus, it's a one box, one brief case break, plus a box of 2021 Hit Parade, fourth and goal. It's a nice little mixer here. Big thanks everybody right here for getting in on the action. I appreciate the people who bought their spots straight up. And uh, congrats again to the people who won their spots in those Prism Cello Pack fillers. All 32 teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams two and a four, six times for names and teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. PJ, down to Josh. Two and a four, six times for the teams. One, two, three, four, five, and sixth and final time. Good luck. After six, we got the Tampa Bay Buccaneers down to the Atlanta Falcons. Now, there will be a proper trade window in this break, so think about trades if you'd like. PJ with the Buccaneers, Adam with the Lions, Michael with the Bills, Brian with the Colts, Aaron with the Raiders, Asa with the Rams, Oliver with the Ravens, Kime with the Eagles, Josh with the Chargers, Eric with the Seahawks. Anthony with the Dolphins, Paul with the Washington football team, Travis with the Packers, Ryan with the Broncos, Jonah with the Panthers, Brian with the Giants, Jose, Niners, Jarrett with the Browns, Kime with the Patriots, Nick with the Titans, Mike Tower with the Texans, PJ with the Bengals, Allen with the Chiefs, Asa with the Bears, Jed with the Saints, Nick Stover with the Cowboys, Sean with the Jets, Josh with the Jaguars, Bennett with the Cardinals, Stephen Davidson with the Vikings, Aaron, Steelers, Josh, Falcons. Let's sort by column B. And we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades. Then the break. Stick around. BRB. All right. Uh, welcome back, folks. We got a deal done. A trade was done. We got Aaron out of the Steelers spot and into the Dolphins spot. Anthony had put the Dolphins up for trade. Anthony accepts the Steelers. We'll put a T there for trade so we can see who draws first blood in this quick little two box break. Let's print, let's rip. Good luck, everybody. We're gonna save the uh, flawless case for last. And let's pop this fourth and goal box open. 85 out of 100, Hit Parade Football, Series two. Four items inside. There's a, a football or a, a jer an autographed jersey, an eight by ten, a mini helmet, and a full size helmet. So let's see what we got. <laughs> it's, it's, a, it's, it's my Friday, Rex. Feeling generous. Of course we're playing Who Am I, Oliver, sorry. Come on, we're playing Who Am I. Of course we're playing Who Am I. All right. First one out of the gate. Hmm. It's the 8 by 10. Who are you? All right. Well, put on your thinking caps, folks. We're about to play America's Favorite Game. Who am I? I'm going to give you some clues, and you're going to try to guess who these uh, who these people are. Um, I guess the college rules apply, or no checklist rules apply to the helmets. All right, and the photos are going to be obvious because his team is on there. But if for whatever reason they're in their college helmet or something like that, it'll go to the team that they're currently on if they're active, or the team they played for the longest if they're inactive. Who am I? I am a retired running back. I was drafted third overall out of UCLA in the early 80s. A running back. UCLA, early 80s. Played for one team my entire career and was a three-time pro bowler. Part of this team's ring of honor. And I was an NFL rushing leader in what looks like my second, the second year of my career. But a pro bowler, three different years. First team all pro and a second team all pro as well.
I'm one of the few running backs in NFL history to average four yards per carry in every season I played. I played from 81 to 92. From 90 to 92, I was the lead plaintiff in a case won by jury verdict that struck down NFL's Plan B free agency system under which teams could protect 37 players. Myself and the seven other plaintiffs were among the protected players listed by their teams. The system was deemed too restrictive and a violation of antitrust laws. However, myself, was uh, I was not among the four plaintiffs awarded damages. Interesting. This suit is considered a major step in the achievement of free agency rights by the NFLPA. So it's part of, part of uh, industry history. Played from 81 to 82. Out of UCLA, first round pick, third overall in the 81 draft. I should write down who has this well. Yeah, off on the years a little bit. It's uh, for the Jets. It's Freeman McNeil. He's got a nice autograph, too. I don't know, maybe, maybe some of you old school guys may know Freeman McNeil. Freeman McNeil right here as well. That is for the Jets. That's going to go to Sean Maddock and the Jets. Yeah, Glowbug remembers. He was, yes, yeah, Oliver says, saw the picture, and I knew, and he knew right then and there. Yeah, I, I guess I haven't really thought about this name in a, little, in a little bit. All right, Freeman McNeil. Sean Maddock has the Jets. Next up. It's the full size helmet. Inside the mini helmet is the full size helmet. Or inside the full size helmet is the mini helmet. So let's try to get the. You know what? I'll do the jersey first. Might be a little bit easier. All right. So this, I think, is in this player's college uniform. similar to his pro team color just want to double check before I start giving you clues although he did play for that team the longest so okay so it doesn't matter um, okay who am I a, a retired quarterback born in Boise Idaho 6'2", 212 played for two teams my entire career and one my last year was on a practice squad a PFWA all-rookie team in the late 90s, a Heisman Trophy finalist in 1996, a Pro Bowler, one-time Pro Bowler, and a two-time first-team All-Pac-10. Finished with 161 touchdowns and 161 interceptions, passer rating of 74.6, part of the College Football Hall of Fame. I went to Arizona State. Think about it. Arizona State QBs, late 90s, second-round pick, all rookie team and a Heisman Trophy finalist. Who am I? Oh, yeah, everyone got it. Oliver, Aaron, Phonic, yep, Jake Plummer. It's a custom jersey, so I'm going to leave this folded in here, but there's his autograph. And there's the Beckett sticker. I suppose this is a custom jersey, right? Yeah, it's a custom jersey. But this must be Arizona football Cardinals colors. I guess it's too too bright of a red for uh, 
for Arizona State colors, right? It's more of a more of a darker maroonish kind of red there, but there you go. Bennett Page has the Arizona Football Cardinals. Let's do the big helmet first, because then I have to dig through and get the mini helmet, and blah, 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 blah. Who am I? Another retired football player, former wide receiver, out of, uh, born in Louisiana, 5'11", 188. Drafted in the late 60s, 1969, in the fourth round. Played for three teams my entire career. And then was a, uh, and then was a coach for a little while, too. Three-time Pro Bowler. Ended up with 750 receptions, 12,146 receiving yards, 65 receiving touchdowns. I am a Hall of Famer. Pro Football Hall of Fame. Who am I? When I retired, I retired with the most career receptions, receiving yards, and games played of any wide receiver in NFL history. And I was inducted into the Hall of Fame in, the, in 1996. Not Roy Sellers, not Paul Warfield. Yep, Jonah's got it. It's Charlie Joyner. You can see the, the Chargers yellow right there. That's Josh Melton with the Chargers. Nice, and hold on. I'm going to try to... I'm going to turn off that top camera really quick because I don't. I want to try to hide the, uh, the mini helmet that I'm about to pull out of here. I don't want to show this off too early. All right, the mini helmet's in the box, over in the box over there. You kind of heard me tumble in, into this box over here. All right, nice. Ooh, nice Charlie Joyner autograph. You got some inscriptions on there as well. Thanks, Charlie. Nice, that old navy blue the Chargers had. That's pretty cool. Big lightning bolts right across it as well. That's pretty sweet. You got the uh, JSA card on the inside. There's the corresponding sticker on the back of the helmet. Once again, his autograph. Nice coached for a while too. San Diego Chargers assistant coach, Bills assistant, Kansas City assistant. And I think up till 2012 was the Chargers wide receivers coach. I didn't realize he was he was that active in the coaching ranks. All right, so once again, that's Josh with the, uh, yeah, Josh Melton with the Chargers. Pretty cool. All right, and the mini helmet that I put in here. Let's see, who are you? Where's, does he have a name on there? Okay. Who am I? Finally, an active player. I think all these guys have been retired players. All right, who am I? I'm an active quarterback in the NFL. Born in this city of, where is this city? Oh, born about 40 miles west of Fresno, California. Why didn't you go to Fresno? I, he did not go to Fresno. He was a Fresno State fan, though. Should have gone to Fresno State. Played for one team my entire career. A second team All-Pro, a one-time Pro Bowler. A career 67 touchdowns to 31 interceptions in my career. Also have uh, 1,500 rushing yards, 25 rushing touchdowns, one receiving touchdown. I have 9,707 passing yards. I don't know what else to say without giving it away. No, no, I should have gone to Fresno State. He was born near Fresno, but he didn't go to Fresno State. 
And he was a, this is going to give it away, he was a seventh overall pick in the NFL draft. I ended up going to Wyoming instead. So think about your Wyoming quarterbacks drafted in the top ten. Yeah, and this person tried to trade this team. Yep, Oliver's got it. Josh Allen. Yeah, Wyoming's the dead giveaway. I didn't realize he was he grew he was born and grew up forty miles east of Fresno. West of Fresno in Firebaugh, California. And he grew up a Fresno State fan, but ended up in Wyoming. Tried to trade, couldn't trade Mojo. That's Michael Robinson, who had the Bills up for trade for a moment. Nice mini helmet. And with each pro season he's had, he's just gotten better and better. So I'm interested to see what his evolution, what, what he's going to look like this year. There you go, and flawless hit parade, Michael Robinson. Congrats. All right, now we've got a handful of cards that have flawless to do. And, of course, Josh Melton, there's your name right here. It's kind of hard to see, but... The football, you can see the Charlie right there, Charlie Joyner. All right, that was the, the full-size helmet. All right, now 2019 Flawless Football. Good luck, everybody. Let's do the uh, slider box cards first. Got a blockchain card on top. A blockchain card is going to be Russell Wilson. Blockchain patch autographs for Seattle. And here's the final printout once again, just to remind you. And Seattle is going to be Eric with that one. And we'll use this blank card right here to slow play the hits a little bit. Good luck. We've got Tony Pollard. Five out of ten, two-color patch. That's for Brian S. and the Colts. Last spot mojo. Eleven out of twenty. Kurt Warner Rams Super Bowl swatches. That is for Asa and the Los Angeles Rams. I guess St. Louis Rams for for this guy, but Rams this just the same. Honored Inc. Chris Long, 18 out of 25. Eagles. That is for Kaim. Greats autograph Steve Atwater, 7 out of 15. For my rivals, the Broncos. Denver Broncos, Ryan Heinz with the Broncos. Michael Vick, Falcons edition, 2 out of 15. Josh Cohen with Atlanta. A couple more. We've got 
Jarrett Stidham, 13 out of 20. Three color patch and autograph. Pats, Kime with the New England Patriots. And the final one out of here. Whoa! NFL Shield, Meikle Hardman Jr. Shield and autograph. Ooh. Alan Murdoch got randomized the Kansas City Chiefs and gets the NFL Shield and auto. Meikle Hardman Jr. That's pretty sweet. Nice, Alan. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Getting the speedster. They got a couple speedsters on that team. Him and Tyree Kill. Pretty nice. All right. Now the encased cards. So let me peek a little bit. Let's see. I want to save the biggest hit to last. All right, all right. Let's go this side first. David Montgomery, 6 out of 10. Kind of hard to see, but that's a sapphire right there. Bears, Asa. The card in the middle is Ruby Kyler Murray. Color match, 10 out of 20. Bennett with the Cardinals. And last but not least, it's going to be Dwayne Haskins. Three-color patch and autograph, 10 out of 20. Rookie patch auto for the Washington football team, Paul Norton. Might be a wait-and-see kind of situation with Dwayne Haskins. See how, see how he does in the future. But there you go. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. This tells you all the gems are naturally mined, not lab-grown. The case is closed on this uh, flawless and hit parade. Mixer. Thanks everybody for buying in, for getting in, for joining the action. I appreciate it. I'm Joe Jaspi. I'll see you next time for the next break. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.